Yo, what is going on guys? It is Kid Murph. We're back with another epic video. In today's video, I'm actually going to be teaching you guys how to be making the text. Well, this is a thumbnail tutorial, but I'm going to be doing it in parts. Like, this is going to be part 1, part 2, part 3, part 4, and part 5. I think I'm just going to do like uh, 5 parts or less. I'm not sure, but let's hope it's going to be less. So, I'm going to make a whole playlist and stuff. So, yeah guys, make, make sure you like this video. Get it to like 25 likes if y'all really want some more PS Touch tutorials and Pixel App tutorials because I'm going to be like using two apps. So yeah, first of all, in this tutorial, we're going to be uh, talking about the text. Yeah, like I said, the text. So you just need to open up Pixel App. So just go download it on the Play Store, Pixel App. It's a free app. And then add text over there. Let's make it a little bigger. And then go to your font and then choose whatever you want or you can go to the font and then download some fonts and then put them over here just search other tutorials to go know how to do that because I'm not doing that in that video um, I'm not talking about that in this video so yeah I'm choosing Hamburg with personal use font something like that and then I'm typing over here your making it a little bigger yeah, so it's basically this. Just gotta make it nice and big and look nice. Like that's that's all you gotta do over here. You you don't really need to edit anymore in, in Pixel App. Just 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 do the text and everything. Yeah, that's it. And then now you press this button right over here. Save as image. And then choose PNG over here. Don't choose uh, JPG with no transparency you, you gotta choose PNG and then save to gallery boom it's done now let's move on to PS touch now in PS touch you just gotta download it on like some random sites maybe just go to Chrome and then type in uh, PS touch download APK or something like that and then you can get the app and make thumbnails like me <laughs> yeah or something like that anyway just open up PS touch and then once you're in, you're gonna want to say black document and then choose 1280 by 720. That's gonna be the size of the thumbnail picture. That's the one that YouTube uses to put on thumbnails and stuff. Then press this plus button, photo layer, photo library. I just choose quick pick. Then you're gonna go all the way down to uh, Pixel Lab. And then choose that word that you chose over there which is your and then you got it nice over there and then select pixels make it gradient and then you choose whatever gradient you like there's some gradients that uh, PS Touch offers you and then I made my own over here that's gonna be for another video but yeah I just made this gradient it's, it's, it's pretty easy you just put two colors at the side like left and right and then you made a gradient boom it looks like that and then you put tick and then deselect and then you fill in stroke like change the type to stroke instead of fill then you choose your color the one that's similar to that one so you go over here then try and put it like somewhere here yeah now it looks kind of nice and then Then you uh, do drop shadow, one, two, yeah, so you only gotta do it like twice, and then all you gotta do now is, is duplicate, lay, choose the your that is under this one over here, and then all you gotta do is fill in stroke change the color into black and it's gonna look like that then you can fill stroke again and then now to fill in the white spaces all you got to do is switch to to the paint tool and then color in this but make sure your color stays black okay and then merge down this UR with this UR over here 
merge down boom it looks like that now you fill in stroke once again but this this color this time is white and it's going to look like that and choose maybe number number three i think yeah three three px and then tick now you put the drop shadow one and two and then there you go you have your own font over there your and then if you guys want to add some some more uh, text in it you can put like your thumbnail so I'm gonna put that in just now I'm just gonna do the same method but with different colors okay So yeah guys, thank you so much for checking out this video, and yeah, peace and bye bye.